And what I love about Amber is her stickers are different. From hey y'all, this is Rochelle and welcome or welcome back to my channel, Rochelle's Plans. Thank you for joining me for another video. And in today's video, I am going to be sharing with y'all my latest order from Plenty Thing. Okay, y'all. So here is the postcard that you get from Amber from Plenty Thing. Um, whenever you do place an order, don't know who Amber is. Amber is the owner of Plenty Thing and she is from the Netherlands. And this postcard just have everything that I guess or assume that it's important to her or that is synonymous with the Netherlands. I don't know what that word is. Kinder, Dijuk, I don't know. Gouda cheese, uh, blendum, stroop waffles, and tulip fields. And this just says, thank you for ordering from the Netherlands. And that's Amber right there. And then this is the back. It has, this is a thank you, all of her social media platforms. And yeah, so this is her, um, card that you get in all of your orders. So now let's go ahead and open this up. Recently, Amber just had another fall release and I will include all the details in the description box below. This order here was from her last release. And I just want to show y'all everything that I got. And I do think that these are still available. I do know that some items are low in stock, but I got two sticker books and then one pad. So let's go through the pad first. Okay, <clears throat> the notepad. Okay, so this says plenty thing at the bottom. And you can tell here that it is Halloween themed. Oh, and look at the back, y'all. The back. We've seen this before, right? It's one of her illustrations from her last year's sticker books. And I think that these illustrations are from one of her sticker books from this year as well. So y'all, I don't know how many sheets you get, but this is good or will be good. If you don't necessarily want to take your planner out, you have this on your desk, you can make your short to-dos, your top priorities, things like that. You can do your, put your bills on here, just quick, short, at a glance, things you need to do or bills you need to get, or bills you need to pay. So this is really cute though. I love the border here, this purple with the spider web detail. And then look at all of the different icons on here. I love it. Even though I don't celebrate Halloween, you know, I will use some Halloween stuff. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I think it, it, it's kind of, I say I don't celebrate Halloween, but I do like the little playful Halloween type stuff, if that makes sense. You know, does that make sense? I don't know. Anyway, what? let's flip through. Oh, let's open up this package here. One of the sticker books. I think she had about four sticker books that released. I think, y'all yeah, only got two. Now, when I say I don't celebrate Halloween, I don't like that gory, really like scary Halloween looking stuff. Um, so I don't get that. If it's cute, pink, playful, I'll get that because I have made Halloween spreads in the past. So y'all, this one is called Autumn Tones Plain Boxes. It includes 594 stickers on 30, stick, 30 sticker sheets. And yeah, so let's flip through this. So this just screams fall. And what I like about Amber stickers are that they are, they're thicker. They're not that, they're not that flimsy sticker paper. So you don't have to worry about it being flimsy if you've never ordered from her shop. Oh, and let me just say here, I'll, I am an affiliate for Plenty Thing and you can save 10% off of your order by using my code Rochelle10. That'll be included in the description box as well. So you've got this, you've got your shades of orange. So you've got orange, orange, peach, and then like this pale orange. So you get two sheets of those. Then we move into like the more muted tones. Like this is not that bright yellow, but then this is, looks like a cream. And this may be, is this terracotta or like taupe? 
to get two sheets of those. And then you've got this, not red, not brick red, but like a faded red. This like seafoam green. And I think this is maybe like taupe. So two sheets of those. And these would be good for layering, stacking, making to-do lists. You can even draw on these stickers, um, making lines on here for a different to-do list is what I'm trying to say. So it looks like the colors are going to repeat from the boxes um, at first that I showed initially, just in a different design. And y'all, don't pay attention to my nails. I'm going to get my nails done. I just haven't had time and they look terrible. So let's just go ahead and get that elephant. But let's address the elephant in the room. They look terrible. I know it. But anyway, we're moving on. So then you have these boxes here. These can be used for your sidebar or you can use it on a specific day. Looks like it will take up maybe, I know at least one full box in the Happy Planner size vertical or standard vertical box, maybe two, but yeah. I will do a plan with me, not in this video, but later on how to use these stickers in conjunction with your other stickers that you may have. Okay, so you have some circles here. These are can be good for stacking. If y'all if y'all do currently pages, you can use them there as well. So these are just plain boxes that you can use for function. Okay. So you got the I like these colors here. These are good fall colors and I know they're gonna pair well with her release this other sticker book I'm going to show y'all okay then you got the large these are I'll say these are extra large circles two sheets of those I love that she includes two sheets because if you want to stack them you know you can have two sheets of those these are good fall colors oh and then you have hexagons And then we've got the yellows or the neutral, neutral colors here. And then we go back to the red, the green, and the taupe or brown, whatever color you want to say it is. And then you've got your extra large hexagons as well. <clears throat> I love this color palette. For some reason, it's just drawing me in. I like these colors, okay? So this is Autumn Tones Plain Boxes. Uh-oh, now you can see it, okay? And next here, let me get this open. So this is Cozy Autumn, and it includes 588 stickers on 30 sticker sheets, y'all. This is just a sneak peek. Look at the front of this sticker book. Now, this sticker book here is getting low on stock. Let me just look really quick so that I can tell y'all. But she did send out, or she posted on her Instagram page that it's getting low in stock. So if you guys want this sticker book here, you need to make sure that you're following Amber on Instagram so that you are aware of any, and me as well, that you are aware of any upcoming releases and if she's running low on stock because she does update that information on her Instagram. Okay, it doesn't say now because you know on Instagram the stories only last 24 hours, but I would suggest if you want this sticker book, if you want this one, then you need to get it ASAP because if not, it will sell out. And I don't think she restocks these. I'm not sure. So let's see here. All right. So let's flip through here, y'all. And what I love about Amber is her stickers are different from other planner shops. When I say different, it's because she 
her sticker books, her stickers are like that old time feeling, somewhat say like barn, farmhouse. That's why her stickers like retro and I love it. I like her colors that she uses also. So here is a cozy autumn, the first sheet here and these are on clear paper. I love it. I like the browns and the oranges and the creams. I just, I love this. This is just cozy for fall. So you get two sheets of those. And then you have like the fall treats. You have here, that looks like a cinnamon roll. Could be like a cherry or apple pie. You've got some coffee here, a latte. I'm gonna call this a sweet potato pie because I don't eat pumpkin pie. A donut, you've got donuts here or all those cookies. Then you've got like a pumpkin spice latte, a cruller, I think. Another type of coffee, some cinnamon sticks. Y'all, this is just, I love it. So you can use pumpkin jam. Use these to add dimension to your planner spreads. So you get two sheets of those and these are clear. And then you have the matching functional boxes. And then you have more deco. So this is good to use to fill in those white spaces. If you don't like a lot of white space, these are good for that. And you could also use them to layer. So you get two sheets of those and these are clear. Okay, and look at this sheet here, more cozy items. So you've got the sweaters here, you've got blankets and books on top of that, some leaves, some citrus here. Is this a toboggan or a hat, charcuterie board? more cake, an apple, a fall candle, two sheets of those. The sticker books not want to want to cooperate. So then you have the matching or the coordinating functional boxes and you get two sheets of those as well. And this here, so this is a darker tape or darker colorway than the first set there. So here you have, okay, I like this scene here where you've got the girl with the boots and then you've got like the bench here with the leaves. You have a table here with a lantern. What are these called? A mum and then a pumpkin, more coffee, the truck with the fall things on the back, the haystack here. I like this, I like this a lot. I think I'm going to use these for my fall monthly spread. So just stay tuned for that video. It is coming up. So you've got a mushroom. These look like apples. Somebody, they went apple picking. Are these books? Oh, look, look, y'all. Look at the um, caramel apple here. More cinnamon rolls. This looks like a dried citrus. You know how you can make... What is it called? I don't know what it's called, but you make, it's kind of like potpourri, but it's like that liquid that you make to have your house smelling good. So I think you use, like you cut up an orange. I think you may use like clove, cinnamon, and some other type of essential oil, but that's what I think when I see this. Again, sweet potato pie. I'm pretty sure that's pumpkin pie though, but for me, it's sweet potato pie. A camera. I don't know what this is. You got some fall socks here and a sweat, a thick sweater and some corn here that's in the shuck. Y'all, is that a pear? It's gonna be a pear today. Okay, and then you have the functional, the coordinating boxes. Y'all, this is a good sticker book. This is a really good sticker book. Ooh, okay, and then look at these here. So you can create scenes in your spread using these stickers here. So you've got the house here, the road going up to the house with the mountains in the back. This says fall here. I don't know if y'all can see that, but it just says fall. Okay, and then you have this here. So I like these colors. And I like the, the fact that you can make different scenes using these stickers here. If you don't know, Amber is good about including these types of stickers in her sticker books. Look at the little beetle, beetle or the bug car. Two sheets of those. Okay, more fall icons. You've got like the fences here. 
the tree. So you can make just like, okay, what's good about this is, so you see how you have your scenes here? So she included in this page here, the different elements where you can make your own scene. The coordinating stickers here. Okay, now these are like the woodland creatures here. I love this. So what is this? Is that not a porcupine, but a hedgehog? Y'all, I don't know. Is this an almond? Maybe. Um, a pine cone, the leaves turning, more coffee. That's an owl, a squirrel, a gourd, cinnamon rolls. Look at that. That cinnamon roll looks so good. Now, what is she petting? Is that a cat? I hope that's a cat. Okay, and then the fireplace or the fire burning. So you get two sheets of those. And then look at this colorway. So you've got an umbrella. This is a pie. I don't know if that's lemonade, but I would assume that's maybe like tea or something, but it's not dark like tea. You've got the stack of books here, another sweater, the stack of mugs, books, then boots and thick socks and the cat there curled up. I don't say curled up by the fireplace. And then the coordinating functional boxes as well. So y'all, that is everything that I got from the last fall release. But again, if you want, Plenty Thing has a new release available. I think these sticker books are still available for purchase, but if you want them, don't wait. Run over to her shop. Run over to her site, uh, plainthingshop.com. Again, all of the details will be included in the description box below. With this new release, y'all, there are like so many rolls of washi. A new, I think it's an A5 dot grid notebook. I think there are two sticker books, and then some like cardstock paper. All right, y'all. So that is everything from my order. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to follow me over on Instagram at Plan with Rochelle. And thanks so much for watching. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.